This week we have Snow White and the Huntsman. Wake up, wake up, it's not that bad. Lips red as blood, hair black as night, bring me your heart. My dear, dear Snow White. Snow White and the Huntsman is a thrapping action adventure medieval joust fest. Kristen Stewart is Snow White, sort of like Snow White channeling her inner Joan of Arc. And Charlize Theron overacting like you've never but seen. But thank God. It's it's only mildly right. embarrassing. <laughs> it's entertaining. It's more entertaining than anything else that happened to the dwarves. There's the problem I have with the dwarves. If you're going to have a movie with dwarves, hire real dwarves. Yeah, don't don't get yes. Ian McShane and Eddie Marson and, sure and all these great the British dwarf. character actors and digitally shrink them I down. That's, that, that must go against some union rules. I, I was entertained in places. You fell asleep. I was really bored. Yeah. I mean, more Charlize, please. Uh, Although, enough. Enough. But which, you know, it's not the actor's fault. It's no, you know, I, no. It's, he's good, and Kristen Stewart is good. I just don't, I don't need any more of these like movies that end with a huge medieval battle sequence. Right. I just, I'm done with that. <laughs> That's Snow White and the Huntsman. I'm Ty Burr. I'm Wesley Morris for the Boston Globe.